I'm Gina from Ovia Health. At Ovia Health, our mission is to improve the world for women and families. And part of that mission is initiating important conversations around what it's like to be a working parent and how can we better support our women and families in the workplace. One of the biggest challenges of being a working parent is childcare. So we interview different women with different childcare situations to learn all about uh, the different choices and options for childcare and how they went about making that decision. So I started looking at daycares, didn't really know what I was looking for, um, didn't know if I wanted a center or a home daycare. I should have prepared way more and for this one I'm preparing a lot more um, and it's, uh, yeah, I just didn't know what I was doing at all. I know the questions to ask daycares where I didn't know before, I just show up and look around. Um, now I understand like what do they do during the day and you know just little questions like that that I had no idea before. What does the structure look like? How many kids are there? How many babies they had? The biggest one for me was who comes in and out of the house because we like home daycares. Um, you know, when there's other family members that bring home friends, or it just kind of scared me. So I just wanted to stay away from that. My husband and I, it made sense to do. Well, we were lucky. We were really lucky. We have both of our moms are nearby, so they offered to help out a little. So my mom does Mondays and his mom does Fridays, and so we were looking for part-time daycare. Um, and we, some people will like really focus on having daycare that's um, gonna really stimulate their child and be the most uh, progressive like learning environment. And for us, it was just like convenience and do they care? Are they nice? I think it's very, and, and price actually. <laughs> So for me, top of mind was convenience, just because I knew that it was going to be hard. Um, where daycare costs are just unbelievably high, if you can even get a spot. Um, I visited some daycares when I was four months pregnant, got on the wait list, and I think I eventually got a slot in one of them when the baby was maybe three months old already, and I'd already made alternate plans. So um, childcare is really important, and um, I think the benefit of where I live is that I was able to do a nanny share. So essentially we ha have one nanny and we share with another baby. So um, we split the costs with this other family and the nanny takes care of both babies um, full time. And it's just been fantastic. It's, uh, it's cheaper than daycare and it um, is so much more convenient. You save so much time. Um, so we ended up going with an au pair um, through the, the federally mandated program. Um, and an au pair is someone from a different country who comes and lives with you. Um, they can do a minimum of 12 months and then can extend if they want for a maximum of another 12 months. Um, our au pair is extending for, for nine months, so she um, she's worked out really well. She lives with you, you pay them a stipend, and also, of course, cover room and board. Um, and it has, uh, it's really worked out well for our family. Um, I thought about childcare pretty much right away. Um, you know, I, I realized I was pregnant pretty early on, just a couple weeks later, and that was a big decision factor. I said to my mom, you know, want to be a grandma and, you know, I'm going to need help. And she signed on right away. I mean, she was very excited. I was pretty insistent that we get a nanny. I just could not grasp doing three drop-off and pickups right when I went back to work and one of them being a six-month-old baby who screamed every time he was put in the car. I just could not fathom it. Um, so we ended up getting a nanny with the thought that we would just do it for six months to a year depending on how things worked out but like having that end in sight of when it wasn't going to be so expensive even though daycare is pretty expensive, but like having a nanny is way more expensive. Just having that end goal in mind was made it an okay decision.